Hello, citizens of the imagination of Theodora. Welcome to the Frontiers of Planetary Besides 4. Glorious Theodora Empire will uh, inherit or succeed the Byzantines. Yeah. 90% with Mamluks here. Base tax is overrated. Yeah, I know, right? We can be rich without base tax. Trade money, yo. Let's get our morale. Defensive ideas. Mmm, how I love you so. Alright. We need Polin. Polin, why you no fight me with me? We need you to fight with me. Is this the same claim we've been fabricating for like past 15 minutes or something? Yeah, it's it's the same claim in Kirkilise. Which I don't even want that much, really. I kind of want to release Bulgaria as a vassal. Did you fabricate? Valakia fabricated a bunch of claims. Yeah, that's pretty good. What are they going to make them bigger, though? I don't remember what can, what Bulgarian ideas are. Do they have hostile core creation? Hmm. Can somebody check really quickly if Bulgaria has hostile core creation? Because that would be really bad. Let's see if Polin is ready to attack. Polin, come on, Polin! God damn it, Polin! Stupid Polin. Why you no attack? Why do you have an attitude towards enemies minus 40? What kind of attitude is that? He needs to annex Mo <sighs> Of course he will never annex Moldavia because he... It's his march. He will never annex his march. And he will never be smart enough to unmarch his march. <coughs> yes, I've said that. Alright, Ottomans. The Polish opinion of Ottomans. Well, Ottomans don't like Poland. That I, I figured that much. It doesn't say their actual attitude, unfortunately. Alright, I guess we'll just keep rolling something, I don't know. Maybe we'll wait until Ottomans attack us. They probably never will. Unless we do something stupid, like we create a vassal out of... Create a Byzantium vassal somewhere here. Like out of Venetian territory, maybe? If maybe he... Ottomans could also attack Wallachia. That could also work. <clears throat> hmm. Duh. They don't. Good. Good. Good, 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 good. So we could create Bulgaria's vassal, and they'll be much better vassal than Wallachia. <clears throat> but so far, we cannot annex Wallachia because of the stupid, stupid annex subjects. Well, it's better than losing 10 legitimacy, in my opinion. Like, it's much better than 10 legitimacy. Pretty sure Venice is gonna take over. And neither Muscovy nor Poland is gonna help us. That sucks. How about this war? No, that's also pretty bad. How about this war? No? This one? No. God damn it! How about this war? Muscovy will help us fight uh, the Golden Horde, but not Poland. Poland is very close to help us, though. What if I check this mark? Yeah, then it doesn't change this. That's good. Although the Ottomans will be able to call their allies, which include Tunis and Timurids. Um, probably not good. These guys are allied with Ottomans and Uzbek. So even if I do co non co belligerent, I think I would still be worth it to take stuff from Ottomans? Question mark? So so. So so. It's really so so. Bum 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 ba ba bum 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 ba ba bum bum ba ba. Do we even have a CB on you? Oh, yeah, we do. Tribal feud. Could take declare war on um, on behalf of Crimeans. Uh, da -da, da -da. Trust plus seventeen. My skill. 
No diplomatic occupation, dude. That is very unfortunate. Got lots of money, though. Maybe you could save up for an embassy, or even maybe better, some temples. Now's the time to build some temples. Yay, force limits. What are we producing here? Wine. Yeah, definitely worth it to build some production buildings. What are we producing here? Uh, grain. Probably not worth it. Definitely gonna be worth it here in these two. We don't have to feed our army or anything. We just produce enough by default, it seems. <laughs> Damn, son. That's like most of our income is trade. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. So you are no longer at war with Mamluks. Which means that you probably want to go to war with me. Probably really want to go to war with me. But he cannot, because that would incur the wrath of Poland. Poland and Muscovy. Muscovy. My friend Muscovy. Let's put improve relations with Muscovy. He loves me, but maybe we still need to. How old are you? 69 years old. Oh, that's a pretty good age there. I like your age, if you know what I'm saying. Maybe when this king dies, the next one will be a little bit better. In terms of going to war. Come on, Poland. They're probably threatened or neutral. Yep, same re rebels. Uh, <laughs> same reason why Constantinople is in my hands. Rebels. Rebels. Rebellions. 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 Maybe we should go beat up on Kara. Perhaps. I declare. Oh. Ah, cool. Ottomans have left the coalition. Will they not warn us anymore? Three years for that warning. That's a long time for a warning to expire. Ugh. Why did you even warn me, you stupid, stupid, stupid Ottoman? You stupid Ottoman Turk. Turka, why did you do this? Could support his rebels. That would probably help me. Um, no provinces, really? No rebels? What? This can't possibly be right. He's got unrest here, and it's these are definitely Syrian Ottomans that currently are in Ottoman hands. Uh... Sure. Remove. Remove kebab. Wait, declarance. Anyone else? No? Muscovy nor Poland did like, no, we don't want to fight. Kievian nationalists. That's interesting. This sounds fun, but I'm pretty sure Hungary is just going to stomp these rebels. Yeah, they're winning a war with Serbia and all that. Pretty sure they got this. Oh, man. Oh, we could... Ooh... Ooh, jeez, Louise, Lou. Hey there, hey there, boy. How about we? How about we improve relations with the? Uh... Gena no longer considers me a rival. No, they started considering me a rival. Ah, oh, thank you. That's very, very convenient. We improve relations with Serbia for a little while, and then we take an alliance with Serbia, and then we enforce peace. Yeah, it's not going to be an offensive war, we're just going to enter at the side of the Defender. And then we're going to grab a bunch of territory for Wallachia. Maybe for ourselves. Hmm, as much as I don't like giving land to Wallachia, maybe we'll just take Transylvania for ourselves. Like Vassal. Vassal Transylvania. These are terrible lands, though. Like, really fucking bad. 
The only thing that's good about them is that they have salt and some naval supplies. Other than that, they're just... Ugh. Ugh. Alright, how's the war going? 16%. Yeah, it's gonna take a while for them to fight it out, so I might not even need that alliance. I just need 100%. Uh, sorry, not 100%. 100 relationship with Serbia. To get the declaration going. To get the declaration going? Alright, so we can get another dude. I think we get another ca cavalry dude. Mm, pretty much nothing. You didn't miss anything, really. We're still in the same spot. Kind of thinking and considering about our targets. What what should we do? What should we not do? Poland is a little bit... Uh, sissy. They're being a little bit of, of a pussy. Just a little bit. They don't want to attack Ottomans for us. So we're kind of like, eh. I guess we could enforce peace on Serbia. That's what I, that's what the plan is at the moment. They're losing the war with Hungary. I'm kind of scared, really. Well, let's take the alliance. It's not going to hurt us. Sissy, alas. <laughs> Alright, enforce peace. No. Get out. Get out of here. Alright. So we're fighting. We're fighting. We're gonna be fighting. Where's the fight? Can we even kill him? Unfortunately, we did not become the war leader. But at least that's some conflict for us to participate in, so I'm happy. Nah, we don't have France. What? God darn it, Lithuania. Really? <sighs> Sit down, Lithuania. Come on. We're not the war leader, apparently, so we can't call anybody in, but it's okay, we still get to play around. Not sure if Crimea could even, like, get access through Lithuania. I was hoping they could. But I don't even know anymore. Come on, Lithuania, really? Ah, on Hungary's side, nah, they don't have anybody. They really only have themselves and Transylvanians, that's it. It's still quite a bit, I mean. They have like three times our army. But it's okay. They just take six, and we're tech seven. We're badasses, and they're not. Okay. Yay, recruiter. <coughs> recruiter! Recruiter! It's a defensive war. Hungarians want to take Bosnia. And I'm pretty sure they didn't take it yet. Yeah, they didn't take the war goal yet. Somehow they did manage to grab Donji Kraji. Hmm. How? History. Oh. Oh! No, oh, it was a long time ago. Okay. So it was just occupied. I see. Oh, Serbian army died it. I'm kind of hoping to just kind of have a little bit of fun. Moving units around and such. <laughs> Yay, fun times! Alright. <sighs> also, I'm kind of trying to bait the Ottomans into false 
illusion that I am kind of weak or busy in a war or something like that. Ah, we got Maros. Yay, it's sieged. Good job, Valakia. You have sieged the province successfully. Damn straight. Austria getting wrecked? Well, it seems like it. They're fighting in France. Heh. <laughs> oh, it's always good. I like when uh, Austria gets wrecked. They didn't want to help us earlier. God damn it! You stupid Axis! Axis shouldn't cost me anything. This is stupid. Alright, let's go. Let's go, boy! What are you doing? What are you doing? You doing something? Are you fighting Switzerland, Ulm, and other people? Moscow is allied with Scotland! Hey, uh. Me bottle of scrumpe. They're both tech six. They do have some cavalry combat ability though, so they're not really that defenseless. Their leaders suck. That is true. Alright, I don't need axes yet, so... I don't need axes anymore, rather. So let's, uh, stop. Stop it with the axes. And with Moldavia... Come on, blip. Blip. Done. Oh shit, kinda missed out on Karaman getting it next. Oh well. Hey there, Luke mean Luke mean Luke mine. There we go. What mission does Muscovy have? They have a mission to subjugate Kazan. Come on, Polen. Polen strong. Polen strong. We must fight. Damn it! Why you no fight? Muscovy would fight. You would not fight. Again, I missed another follower. That's probably Luke, Luke Mine. If you, if it was Luke Mine, then thank you. If it wasn't, then apologize. And we should. Okay, I don't know who that was, but that was certainly somebody. Damn, I really need to fix that follower sound. Uh, notification rather. Like I have a sound, but we don't. I don't have an actual notification. That's weird. <coughs> Good. Good times. At least we can, you know, actually do something. <clears throat> oh, come on. You wanna play? You wanna play? Yeah, he wants to play. No, oh, damn it. Come on. Play. Play with me. Play with my army. Play with some guns. He doesn't have cannons. Where is he going? He's gonna go deal with rebels. Did he notice there are rebels and he just like, Oh, damn, son, I need to deal with those rebels ASAP. Yep, he just did. Well, at least Transylvanians did. Another army of Hungarians. Nope, nope, they're all going for rebels. Never mind. Alright, let's go liberate Serbia. <coughs> Liberation of Serbia must begin. Blah, 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 blah. What was that? I don't even know. It was supposed to be a funny voice, but it was not funny. Something is not working. This is not working. Alright, we get another idea group. Should we take anything or should we take something? Uh, should we take anything or should we take nothing is what I meant. <coughs> Humanist is probably good. It is probably very good. But we had a plan to go with innovative and then uh, combo it with uh, a bunch of a bunch of stuff that gives us more army tradition and army tradition DK. So this gives us army tradition DK, 
minus 2, which stacks up, up to minus 3, and then we also have plus 1 from our um, defensive. Um, it also gives us technology. Yeah, it's good. The earlier we have it, the better. So I think we should take it. <coughs> Could hire some mercs, but... But, 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 but. But, but, but. Probably not worth it yet. Oh, we could have another dude. That's awesome. Oh, she's low, he's low. 44. Uh, we'll lose some legitimacy. It's not good. Ah, yes, he loves us now. Okay, great. So this is... As soon as this war is over... Can I just peace out? No, not yet? Okay, fine. Well, as soon as this war is over, I think we'll be ready to attack Ottomans. Because right now, everyone will be like, Yay! What? Oh, come on, Poland! God dang it! His friendly attitude! Oh, bullshit. Okay, well... Yeah, what was I talking about? I was talking about another dude we could get. Could totally get another cav- Um, uh, not cavalry, artillery unit. We could totally afford that. We should totally get it. I'll probably ferry it over through Valakia or something, I don't know. Also, you suggested that we should siege Bosna. I don't want to split my stacks around. I want to kind of want to keep close. What's that? Oh, we, we got unrest. We got unrest, guys. War exhaustion. Ah, whatever. Poland must be in debt. Yeah, but they also like their uh, like our enemies. Oh no! <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Poland uh, is has attitude. Like, okay, remove the minus thousand would be called into multiple wars. Okay. Attitude towards enemies minus forty. Bam! No more wars. Threatened, I suppose they are. I suppose they're threatened or something. Ah, uh, well. I kind of like artillery. I do that o often. What is this? Serbia will... Come on, Serbia, really? We, we have, we've been having so much fun. And then you just like, surrender, herp derp. Oh, well. You know. It was fun. Goodbye, Serbia. You suck. Yeah, you still suck. I'll come back later when I've reclaimed all of the Balkans and I need your land. Well, wop 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 wop. <laughs> oh, no! Ottomans is no longer a valid rival, really? Seriously? Okay, revoke our embargo. Why can't I. What? Why do I no longer have an embargo on my third rival? Who was my third rival? Hungary. Why do I not have a... Well, it doesn't matter anyway, so whatever. So we could ri rival Golden Horde. Autumn's Mamluks. Or we could rival Kara, who is allied with Hasa. 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 Opinion map mode. Sure, let's go opinion map mode. Where is it? There it is. It's a heart. Yeah, the Ottomans don't really like them. Ah, there it is. It shows. Okay, Ottoman attitude towards Poland rivalry. Poland love themselves. Of course they do. Polish attitude towards the Ottomans. Neutral! It's fucking neutral. And it's still enough to freaking be like, Oh my god, you know what? It's just like, eh. That's a very accurate representation of a Polish person right there. Okay, uh, how soon till this expires? 4094. Muscovy likes us. Muscovy really likes us. Hmm. We don't really need to improve relations with Muscovy at the moment. <clears throat> but if we declared war... Ah! Oi! 
So Muscovy and Poland would both join me in the very righteous war against Golden Horde. They're also allied with Ottomans, Mamluks, Uzbek. <coughs> so Uzbek, Mamluks, Ottomans. Do we... Do we dare calling in... Oh no, no, no way we... No way we dare calling in Ottomans as a co-belligerent. They will all bring, like, all of the Muslims. All of them. Alright, let's count. Oh, Poland... Is it war? No, Poland is not at war. So, Poland has a total of 25,000 with no manpower. Lithuania, on top of that, has 33. I think that's 33. Wait, what was Poland again? Poland was 25. 25, 33. And then there's also Muscovy with another 37. That's quite a bit of troops already. But Ottomans can field 60,000 already. 60,000 already. Golden Horde also has 19,000 dudes, which is. They're kind of shitty dudes, but they're still dudes to stomp. Then we also have. Um, Timurids, which we apparently have not discovered yet. We have not discovered our Timurids yet. 20 euros to such a craft game. Get off! Get out of here, Toba! <laughs> no, never mind, welcome. Alright. Well, the, the Ottomans will get cold no matter what. I'm just worried about their allies. Tunis, Timurid, and Mercuria. Tunis is kind of far away, but they will reach us through Mamluks. Like, their problem is that they're so spread out, and we're gonna be able to just stomp everything here. So what I'm thinking is I need, I could uh, grow my little vassal by expanding through these border provinces. While also, maybe, stomping Ottomans into shit and releasing something from them. But that would cost me more points if I called them as a, a non-co-belligerent. Oh shit! Um, I think we need to go with a um, with a non belligerent Again, somebody followed, and I can't even see that. Damn it! All right. Well, we done did. Come on, Paulin. You promised. You promised me, Paulin. Don't fuck me up. All right. Nice job, Paulin. Very good choice. A wise decision. Let the games begin. But it's time to put a cut here. <laughs> it's time to put a cut here in between YouTube episodes. So thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to comment, rate, and possibly subscribe to my channel for like this. I'll see you again next time as always. Have a good day.